Lord, we thank you, Lord, for grace of your love in our life. Let's thank him. Let's appreciate him. Let's give that honor to him. Let's give that praise to the Lord. Let's begin to appreciate him. Let's honor the Jehovah God. God Almighty, we thank you. Let's worship him and give God a praise. Let's honor the Lord. Let's appreciate him. Thank you, El Shaddai. Thank you, Almighty God. We worship you. We exalt you. We magnify you. We honor you. Let us begin to thank him. Father, we thank you, Lord, this morning. Great is thy faithfulness towards us. Great is your love towards our life. Great is your power towards us. Let's thank him. Let's appreciate him. Let's give that honor to him. Honor the Lord. Honor to Jehovah God. Honor to Almighty God. Let's thank him. Great is our faithfulness for what he has done for us, for what he will do. Let's give him praise. Let's give that praise to him. Let's give praise to him. Let's give that honor to him. Lord, we thank you. Lord, we worship you. Lord, we exalt you. Lord, we magnify you. Thank Holy Spirit of God. Thank Almighty God. Let's worship Him and give that honor to Him. Worthy is the Lamb that was slain. Worthy is the Lamb that was slain. Worthy is the Lamb that, that died for us on the cross of Calvary. Worthy is the Lamb that redeemed us. Let's give that honor to the Lord, that honor to the King this morning, and appreciate Him for the love of God towards you, for the love of God towards your life, for the love of God towards my life, towards your family. Let's lift our voice and worship Him. Jesus, we thank you. Let his name be praised. Let his name be honored. Let the name of Jehovah God be praised. Let his name be honored right now. Let's give that honor to the King. That praise to the Lord. Let's thank him. Worship him. Worship him. Oh, worship him. Give the Lord the praise. Give the Lord the honor. Give the Lord the glory. Give the Lord the praise. We thank you, El Shaddai. We love you, Almighty God. We give you praise, Jehovah God. Just thank him. Father, we thank you. Father, we honor you. Father, we give praise to you. Father, we honor you. Father, we give praise to you. We thank you, Lord, for what you are doing. Just thank him. Let's thank the Lord. Let's thank Jehovah God. Oh, worship him. Jehovah Shama, we thank you. Jehovah Nisi, we honor your name. We say thank you to you, Lord. We say thank you to you, Jehovah God. We say thank you to you, El Shaddai. We say thank you to you, Almighty God. We say thank you to Him. Father, we thank you. Father, we honor you. We give you praise. We give the Lord the praise. Let's honor the Lord. Let's honor the King. El Shaddai, we bless your name. El Shaddai will worship you. El Shaddai will love you. El Shaddai will honor you. 
El Shaddai, we thank you, we thank you, Jehovah God. We thank you, Almighty God. We thank you, Lord El Shaddai, we honor you. We honor you for what you have done for us. We honor you for what you will do today. We honor you for grace of love. We honor you because you are the Lord Almighty. Glory be to your name. Glory be to your name. Glory be to your word. In our life, we worship you. Let's thank him. Let's say, Daddy, you are great. There is no one like you. You are wonderful. There is no one beside you. We thank you, Lord, for everything. We thank you, Lord, for everything concerning us, concerning our children, concerning our family. Somebody lift your voice and bless the Lord. Lift your voice and worship you, over God. Thank you, Lord, for grace that has given to you. Thank you, Lord, that the love that you have received from him. Thank him for the blessing. Great is the faithfulness of God towards us, towards your family, towards your children. Great is the faithfulness of God towards our life, towards what the Lord is doing to you, to your family, to your life. Let's give that praise to him. Lord, we thank you. Lord, we worship you. Hosanna in the eyes to God. Let's join the host of heaven to thank the Lord this morning. Somebody join the host of heaven to worship Jehovah God. Join the host of heaven to thank him. Join the host of heaven to worship him. Join the host of heaven to thank the Lord. Join the host of heaven to worship Jehovah God. For great is the faithfulness. Lord, we thank you. Lord, we worship you. Lord, we honor you for who you are. Glory be to your name, glorious God. We thank you. Glorious God, we worship you. Glorious God, we honor you. Glorious God, we thank you. Glorious God, we say we love you. Glorious God, we honor that name. Thank him, bless him. Worship the Lord. Oh, thank the Lord. Thank him, thank him, thank him, thank him. Worship him this morning. Thank you, Lord Jesus. We honor you. Worship Worship him, give 
thank you, Mr. Jeremy. Father, we thank the Lord Jesus. Jesus, we thank the Lord Jesus. Father, we thank the Lord Jesus. Worship and thank Holy Spirit. We thank you, Lord. Father, we thank you. Lord, thank you, Lord Jesus. You are so good. Blessed be the name for great thing that he has done for us. For great thing that Lord will do this morning. Appreciate him for his provision. Appreciate him for his love. Appreciate him for his kindness. Appreciate him for the goodness of God. Let's appreciate him for the miracle of God. For the safety, for his protection over us. Let's give that praise to him. Somebody in your own heart, let's worship the Lord in your own heart. Let the name of Jehovah God be praised. From your own heart, let's worship Him. Let's give that honor that He deserves. Let's give that glory to Him. That praise to El Shaddai. That love for God. Thank Him for everything. Thank Him for grace. Thank Him for mercy. Thank Him for kindness. Let's thank Him for goodness. Let's thank Him for abundance of God's love. Abundance of God's grace. In our life, let's declare to Him that He is so good. He is so kind. He is wonderful. There is no one like Him. There is no one beside Him. What a mighty God that we serve. What a mighty God that we worship. What a mighty God. Let's honor the name of our God. Let's honor the name of our King. Let's say to Him, Lord, we bless your name. Lord, we thank you. Lord, I honor you. Lord, we sabbat you. Lord, we bless you. Somebody give that praise to him. Give that honor to the king. Give that love for him. Give that praise to El Shaddai. What a mighty God that we serve. What a king of kings. 
Lord of Lords, Omnipotent God, El Shaddai, God Almighty, appreciate him, appreciate the King, say to him, you are great, there is no one like you, you are great, there was no one beside you, you are great, thank him, give your love for him, give your love for the Lord, give your love for him, Jesus, we thank you, O God, Jesus, we worship you, O God, Jesus, we honor you, O God, Jesus, we bless your name, glory be to your name, glory be to your name, O God, thank you, everlasting Father, in Jesus' name, our Lord, we pray, let's begin to ask our God, let's begin to ask God to forgive every sin, let's acknowledge the very sin in our life, that Lord God of heaven forgive every sin, every sin in our heart. Let's begin to ask the Lord, the over God, forgive us all our sins, forgive us all our iniquity, Father, forgive us all our trespasses. Let's begin to ask the Lord, Father, in any area we have sinned against you, O God, let's begin to ask the Lord, the over God, forgive us every sin sin, every sin in our heart, in our life, let's begin to ask the Lord, Jehovah God, all of our sins, Holy Spirit, forgive us, O oh God, lift your voice and begin to pray, that the Lord God of heaven to forgive every sin, let's begin to ask the Lord, Jehovah God, forgive us every sin, Forgive us all our iniquity. Forgive us all our trespasses. Let's begin as the Lord. Jehovah God, forgive us all our sins. Let's begin as Him, the Lord God of heaven, to forgive every sin in our heart, in our life. Let's lift our voice to Him. Jehovah God, forgive us all our sins, every sin that may be every sin that may be in our life, every sin may be in our heart. Let's begin to ask the Lord, the Lord God of heaven to forgive. Holy Spirit, cleanse us from every iniquity. Cleanse us from every trespasses. Cleanse us from every transgression. In the name of Jesus, open your heart to him. The Lord God of heaven to forgive every sin that may be in our heart, in our life. Lift a voice to God of heaven. Mazuka toya masun to yedava. Riputuya anzi endura anlia. Let's lift our voice to end. The Lord God of heaven to forgive every sin that may be in our life, in our heart, in the name of Jesus. Open your heart to pray. Lift a voice to him. In Tarusutalia, Bokatoria Anziketelevo. Lift a voice to God. Maye Katu de Enzikandeo. Lift a voice to Jehovah God, the Lord God of heaven, to forgive every sin, every iniquity in our heart, every iniquity in our life. Lift a voice to him. The Lord God of heaven to forgive. All our sin, all our iniquity, all our trespasses, all our transgression. Open your heart to pray. Pray and ask the Lord, my Father, Ekarasu Tolia, Bazun Tore Pasintelebo. Lift your voice to Him, the Lord God of heaven to forgive every sin in our heart, in our life. Open your heart to God. God Almighty, let all my sin be forgiven. Let mercy prevail in the name of Jesus. Let mercy prevail in the name of Jesus. Let mercy prevail. Somebody ask the Lord that mercy of God to prevail 
in every area you are looking unto him. Let the mention of God prevail in every area that you are believing God. Let the mention of God prevail in every area that you are trusting him. That is show mercy. Have mercy upon me. Show your mercy, O God. Have mercy upon my life. Show your mercy in my over my children. As the Lord, our Lord God of heaven, to show his mercy in the name of Jesus. Open your heart to pray. As the Lord. Father, let me receive your mercy right now in the name of Jesus. Somebody pray and ask the Lord. Daddy Lord, show me your mercy. Let your mercy prevail in every area of my life. Let the mercy of God prevail. Somebody pray and ask the Lord that the mercy of God prevail in the name of Jesus. Let your mercy prevail in my home, O oh God. Let your mercy prevail in my life, O oh God. Let your mercy prevail. Somebody ask the Lord that the mercy of God will prevail in the name of Jesus. Let's lift our voice to God that the mercy of God will prevail in every area of our life. Father, I need your mercy. Father, I need your mercy. Somebody pray. Talk to God that you need God's mercy. That you need God's mercy in your life, in your home. Jehovah God, I need your mercy. My Father and my God, I need your mercy to turn my life around. Jehovah God, I need your mercy to lift me up in this season. Father, I need your mercy to break forth. I need your mercy to go higher. Pray that you need the mercy of God. Pray that you need the mercy of God. My life needs your mercy, O oh God. My children need your mercy, O oh God. My marriage needs your mercy, O oh God. Somebody begin to pray. Lift your voice to him that you need the mercy of the Lord. Mercy of God to locate you. Let the mercy of God locate me. Let the mercy of God locate my life. Let the mercy of God find me. Somebody pray. Open your heart to God that the mercy of God will locate you, that the mercy of God will find you in every area you are trusting Him, in every area that you are believing God, that you are looking unto Him, that the mercy of God will locate you, that the mercy of God will find you. Open your heart to pray. Pray and ask the Lord, Lord, let your mercy locate me. Lord, let your mercy find me. In the name of Jesus, Father, let your mercy turn my life around. Open your heart to God. My Father, let your mercy turn my life around. Turn my home around. Turn my children around. Turn my family around. Open your heart to Him that the mercy of God to turn your life around. Turn your home around. Turn your children around. Somebody pray. Father, let your mercy turn my life around, turn my own around, and you lift your voice and ask the Lord, you need the mercy of God to turn your life around, to turn your situation around. Open your heart to God. Say, Lord, let your mercy turn my life around. Pray and ask the Lord, Lord, let your mercy rest upon my life. Pray for God's mercy. Pray for God's mercy. Ask for God's mercy. Cry for God's mercy. Open your life to break that yoke in the name of Jesus. To break the yoke of failure. To break the yoke of untimely death. That yoke of struggle in the name of Jesus. That yoke of disappointment. Pray and ask the Lord. Maye kazikayaba. Lord, we pray. Let your mercy break the yoke. Let your mercy break the yoke of enemy in the name of Jesus. Let the mercy of God break the yoke of enemy. Mayikadeya. Let the you that the mercy of God break the yoke of enemies in your life in the name of Jesus. Open your heart to pray. Lift your voice to God that the mercy of God to break that yoke 
Mess of God, deliver me. Mess of God, set me free. As the Lord, I let your mercy locate me. Let your mercy break the yoke of enemies in my life. Somebody pray. That yoke of enemy, that yoke of delay must break. That yoke of enemy, that yoke of delay must break in your marriage, must break over you. That yoke of failure must break in the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name, we pray. Say, Lord, as I look unto you this morning, tell the Lord, they say, I will look unto the ear where I commit my help. Our help is from the Lord. Lord, let me deliver me as I look unto you. Daddy, as I look unto you, I don't know why you are looking unto him. I don't know what you are looking unto him for. But tell the Lord, as I look unto you, Father, deliver me. I want to begin to open your heart to God. Lord, as I look unto you, Jehovah God, save me. Lord, as I look unto you, deliver me. I want to begin to open your heart to God. I want to begin to tell the Lord right now, that as you look unto him, tell him right now, Lord, as I look unto you, that he save me. Lord, as I look unto you, Lord, deliver me. I want to begin to cry to God that as you look unto him, let God of heaven save you. As you look unto him, let God of heaven deliver you. I want to begin to lift your voice to him. Say, Jehovah God, as I look unto you, Lord of heaven, save me. Lord, as I look unto you, Jehovah God, deliver me. I want to begin to lift your voice to him. Lord Almighty, Jehovah God, as I look unto you, save me. Somebody begin to pray to God that as you, as you look unto the Lord, as you cry to God, let God of heaven save you right now. Say, Father, save me in the name of Jesus. The over God, as I look unto you, save me. God of heaven, as I look unto you, deliver me. Let's begin to pray. Let's begin to pray. Let's begin to ask the Lord, my Lord and my Father, as I look unto you, save me, O God. Save me, the over God, as I look unto you, deliver me. As I look unto you, save me. Somebody pray. Let's begin to cry before the Lord that as you look unto Him for your deliverance this morning, as you look unto Him in the name of Jesus for your healing this morning, as the Lord will do so. As I look unto you for that job, as I look unto you for that baby, as I look unto you for that breakthrough, as I look unto you for your healing, let the Lord save you. Let God do it. Father, as I look unto you, deliver me this morning. Somebody pray. As I look unto you, as I run, Father, save me, O God. In the name of Jesus, save me, O God. My life shall be saved. Open your heart to pray. Pray as you look unto him in the name of Jesus. As you look unto God, as you look unto Jehovah God, let God of heaven save you. Save you from the battle of failure. Save me from the battle of disappointment. Deliver me from the struggle. Open your heart. I don't know what you are going through, but you can tell it right now to save you, to do it in your life as I look unto you. Rescue me, rescue my life. As I look unto you, turn my life around. Somebody pray that prayer. Lift your voice to God, Lord of God of heaven. As I look unto you, in the name of Jesus, visit my life. Visit my own, visit our children, Father, as we look unto you, manifest your grace, manifest your power. Somebody pray, lift your voice to him, as you look unto him, let God give you a great turn around, as you look unto him, let God, God of heaven favor you, favor your own, favor your family, as you look unto him, let God of heaven favor your life. Favor your dreams, favor your children. As you look unto him, somebody pray that prayer that as you will look unto the Lord, let God of heaven to visit our line, visit our foundation, visit our children, 
BC, our family, somebody pray that prayer that as you look unto him, let God of heaven do great things for you, do mighty things in your life, and we look unto him in the name of Jesus. Open your heart to pray that as you look unto the Lord in the name of Jesus, begin to pray for a great turnaround. Begin to pray for a great turnaround. La barusu to kalaba. Limprendo sin katero. Open your heart to pray that as you look unto the Lord, let God of heaven give your life a great turn around. As you look unto him, let God of heaven begin to favor your dreams. Begin to favor your children. Begin to favor your family. As you look unto the Lord, let great things begin to happen for you. As you look unto Him, let great things begin to happen in your marriage. As you look unto Him, let great things begin to happen in your family. Somebody pray that prayer. Lift your voice to God. That as you look unto the Lord, in the name of Jesus, let your life receive a turnaround right now. Let the yoke break. Pray. Tell Lord, as you look unto the God this morning, let that yoke of that delay, him that have been troubling your life, let that yoke of that failure, I don't know what you are going to Tell the yoke, the very yoke of that very thing, shame and disappointment. That yoke of delay, backwardness, that yoke of that thing that is happening in your life, I don't know it. That yoke of that thing that you are going through, in the name of Jesus, as I look unto you, the yoke of that sickness, the yoke of that delay, the yoke of that disappointment, open your heart to God. Let it break as you look unto God. As you look unto Him, let the yoke of failure, let the yoke of this disappointment in my life, in my marriage, break, O oh God. As I look unto you, ye kurasun to yadaba, lentrendo shinke telebo, mandaria makusun to yebo, open your heart to pray, the yoke of disappointment, as you look unto the Lord, in the name of Jesus, pray and ask the Lord, as you look unto him, in the name of Jesus, let that what you are going through, power leave your life, let that strength spirit, strength power, disappear in your life, in the name of Jesus, as you look unto God this morning, let that be a great turn around, as you look unto God this morning, let that be a divine visitation of the Lord, divine visitation to your foundation, divine visitation in the life of your children, divine visitation in your own, divine visitation that will bring joy to you, that will bring miracle to you, that will bring fulfillment to you as you look unto you in the name of Jesus. Father, visit your children. Thank you, everlasting Father. In Jesus' name, our Lord, we pray. I want you to lift your voice and say, Father, I need you. Lord, come to my rescue this morning. That's how think that thing, if the story can be changed, you have changed the story. If you can be able to be there by your strength, you should have been there by now. So that's why we look unto God. Things that you cannot do, you look unto God for it. Think the story of life that you cannot change, you look unto God to change it. Where you want to be and the enemy did not allow, or circumstances or situation of life did not allow you to be, you look unto God to do it. Tell the Lord, Lord, I need your help. Send help to my life this hour. Father, I need your help. Over every battle stronger than I, things that someone has been doing for years, where things have been going on years in the life of somebody, over shame in my life. Lord, I need your help. I want to begin to lift your voice and talk to him. Lord, send your help, O oh God, in the name of Jesus. I want to begin to lift your voice to him. Father, send your help, O oh God, in my life right now. Send your help, O oh God. In my own right now, send your help, O oh God. I want to begin to God. The Lord God of heaven begin to send help. Help in your own. Help in your marriage. Help family. Lift your voice and begin to pray. Open your heart to him. In the name of Jesus. 
Father, send help, O oh God, in my life, in the name of Jesus. Open your heart to God, the Lord God of heaven, to send help. Somebody pray in the name of Jesus. Let's lift our voice to God. Lord God of heaven, send help in the name of Jesus. Open your heart to him. My Lord and my God, let there be help in the name of Jesus. Open your heart to him. Somebody pray before the Lord, the Lord God of heaven to send help. Somebody pray and ask him, Father, send your help, O oh God, over my life. Where do you need that help this morning? Where do you need that help this morning? Tell Lord God of heaven to send help. You see, God is our help. At the present times of trouble, tell the Lord to send that help to you. Financial help, spiritual help, marital help. I don't know that area you need help. That area that you need help of God. Tell the Lord, send your help, O God. In the name of Jesus. Send your help to deliver. Send your help to save. Send your help oh, to rescue. Send your help to lead them to a place of liberty. Father, send your help to break the yoke. Father, send help to turn things around. Father, send help. Can we pray? Can you lift your voice to God? Can you cry before Him, the Lord God of heaven, to send help now? Send help now. Open your heart to God. Tell the Lord, send help in my life. Send your help to me. Send your help to me. Pray, pray as the Lord. My Father, let there be help that breaks the yoke. Let there be help that lifts me up. Let there be help that carries me higher. Open your heart to God. Pray and ask Him that the Lord God of heaven to send help now. Lord, let that be help this morning for your children. Help of God. Help in their marriage. Help in the life of their children. Help in their own. In the name of Jesus. Receive that help now. In the name of Jesus. Receive the help of God that breaks the yoke. Receive the help of God. In the name of Jesus. Open your heart to pray. In the name of Jesus. Pray and the Lord should send help. Help of that healing. Help of that deliverance. Help of the manifestation of His glory. In your life. In your home. Let's pray that God go ever to send help. Help that will bring joy to your life. That will bring joy to your home. Peace in your heart. Peace in your family. Pray Lord I need help. My Father send your help now. In Jesus name. We pray. People are taught to be killed next day. But the church prayed. The Lord sent help. God sent his help to them. And Peter was delivered. I don't know what you are going through. It's only the help of God that can deliver you. It's only the God, help of God that can save us. The Bible told us if God did not build the house, the builders are doing it in vain. Even the man want to help him. If God will not help, that will be in vain. The only help that can, you can receive is the help of God. What the help that I need is the help of God. And when God help, it lasts. It's forever. When God help, oh, no one can hold you captive anymore. Whatever God deliver you, if God is one that delivers your life, He delivers you forever. Satan can give you a temporary relief. Satan, he can only give a temporary relief. I was listening to say, Satan will do you and screw you out. Hallelujah. Now me, he's a deceiver. We show that I can do it. At the end, you will corner the person again. You need the help of God. I need the help of God. Say, so let your help manifest. I want you to mention that thing because you are before God of heaven to break the yoke, to heal, and you cannot hide yourself from me, even though he knows. Don't, don't think God don't know what you are going through. Oh, 
Maybe God is not aware, let me tell you. He is aware. God is aware of everything that every one of us is going through. He is not blind to it. But when you pray, you are giving him a, a access to it to come in. Prayer release access for God to come in. He knows it. He knows what you are going through. He knows you are trusting God for the fruit of your home. God knows that you are believing God for the fruit of your home. God knows that you are trusting God for husband. God knows that you are trusting God for greater things. God knows that you are trusting God for him, for healing. So he knows, your father knows what you are going through before you ask. But prayer released access to him. Prayer invited him to come in, to step in. Without telling him, uh, he's not going to do anything about it. God don't prognose. God don't involve what you don't call him to be. Is what you allow him to be is what he will do. Hallelujah. If you say, I can do it on my own, why he wants to help you? You don't need God's help when you can do it on your own. Hallelujah. He help those that their effort is not enough and they are looking on to him for that help. Today, your life will surely find help. Your life will surely find that help. I don't know what you are going through. I don't know what is going through you to this morning. But I pray for solution. I don't know that situation that you are in right now, that you may be. But whatever situation that you may be right now, heaven will bring you out. In the name of Jesus. God of heaven will bring you out. Jehovah God will rescue you. Help will come quickly. Help of God will come quickly. In every area of life, help of God will come quickly for you. Help of God will come quickly for your children. Help of God will come quickly for your marriage. Help of God will come quickly for you. In every area of life, receive that help. Help of God, receive that help. In every area you need it. In every area you need that help. In every area that you are believing God for it. In every area you have up and expectations before the Lord. Receive that help. No more holding back. No more delay. No more holding back that help for your life. No more delay. No more holding back. The help of God for your children. No more holding back. The help of God in every area of life. No more holding back. The help of God for your life. For your dream. For your children. For your family. In every area you are trusting God. In every area you are, you are believing God. Let help come. And let it come speedily for you. Let help come. And let that help come speedily. For your life. Is that not the word God that told us in Psalm 143, verse 7? He said, Hear me speedily. Does anything think you need the attention of God now? Even the night is too late. Certain things need the attention of God now. I'm saying night is too late. Nothing too late for God. I think mean, what I'm saying is that I need God need to show up now for you. And if we are, there is nothing that God cannot do. He can reverse the reversible. Nothing too late for him. They said the, the man is thinking you came late. Hallelujah. God never. God will not. God will not come. Is not late in your life. It's always on time. The holding is late. They said the man died four years, four four days ago, and the man is thinking. He said he should have been here. Maybe that day that we are calling you that the man is sick, maybe the man should be alive. But I realize that it's not too late for God. Hallelujah. He can, every broken species, he can glue it together. He can pick it up. Every, whatever that has been broken, the pieces, God can put it together. I don't know how far you have been. I don't know what the enemy has done. I don't know what they are saying. But today, let help come speedily. Can you lift your voice and begin to pray? Say, Lord, let my deliverance, let my help come speedily. Now, right now, in this year, this year should not elude you. 
This year should not rob you. This year should not rob you of the glory. This year should not rob you of your miracle. This month should not rob you. This is the last night of the month. This month should not rob you of the blessing, of the glory, of the fulfillment that your life has been waiting for. This blessing should not rob you. Repotolia maku parusa. Lenteripa inda ika broda. Lenteripa unsa kuntelia. Bakondoria ika doyaba. Lembrondon shikebon. Reteken toriama in toyadea. Lembrondon shikebon. This blessing of God must manifest. This glory of God must manifest in your life. Somebody pray that prayer. Somebody open your heart to pray. Somebody lift your voice to Jesus. The blessing must manifest. The glory must be revealed. Your joy must come. Your miracle must happen. In the name of Jesus, solution must come. Every difficult situation disappear. Every difficult situation in your life disappear. Every struggle come to an end. Every failure come to an end. In the name of Jesus. Receive that help speedily in Jesus' name. We pray. How many of us is a pastor? Leave us alone. Why you like to ask the question? Because I want to make sure what is going on. I may not sure you know what you need this morning. I mean, you you sure you know you really sure. Sometimes you think people sure of what they need. Ask your you mm, need. Mm, I mean, I don't. What? How many of you you know? That very thing that you need, that don't dare to you wave your hands in the air, wave your hands in the air. Hey, hey, yes, 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 yes. How many of you? So, like Anna, she know what she need. With that, even nobody, even you told the man of God, ah, you a drunk woman. Say no, no. Listen, I'm not a drunk woman. I know what I need. I know what I'm praying for. I know why I'm here. Because she has been ridiculed not only one time, every year. She know is a mockery year. No, because remember they are in the same house. You know, I, I don't know what she'll be doing to her at home already. You know, for them also to the public and the woman also disgracing her, doing things for her like that. Imagine what Anna should have been facing at home. So the woman cannot hold herself. Penina cannot hold herself at also where the gala in the house of God, in the presence of God, is still torment her, do all kind of stuff for her, for make that have made her to be crying. She knows what she needs. She knows what she wants. For you that know what you need, tell her, let it happen. That's the manifest. You see, our God will reveal himself to us. God is not a it, God has differentiated himself. He has defined itself that is not God that has ear that he cannot hear. He is the giver of the ear himself. Not only that he has ear. God is the giver of that very ear that have eyes that he cannot see. He is the giver of the eyes that makes people to see. He. That have mouth. He is the giver of that mouth so someone can speak. I don't know what you need, but you are, now you know what you need right now. Tell them, let this thing happen, O oh God. That the answer me speedily concerning this. Your word told me you can do it. Your word told me all things are possible. Your word told me if I believe, you will make it happen. Your word told me if I call upon you, answer. Your word told me that you will fight for me. That I will hold my peace. Your word told me that you will give back to me. Yes, that no cause. All the wasted year, all year that enemy has robbed me, all year that enemy has robbed me, your word told me that I, I can recover. Oh, my kindly must see the Bakaya. Lebrendo Shika Daya. Your word told us we can make it happen, that our enemy shall be defeated. Your word told us we can overtake and recover. Your word told us we can receive our healing. Repotolia led to Rosatia. Somebody pray that prayer. Let those things begin to happen. God, that all things are possible for. God, that all things are possible for. God, that can do all things. 
open your heart to pray. Let things begin to happen. Let begin to let things begin to happen. Limpendo Let the miracle begin to happen for your children. Let fulfillment begin to come their way. Let their miracle begin to manifest to them. Let their shame begin to disappear. Father, answer to every request this morning. Father, show up over every request this morning. Father, let the miracle happen over every request this morning. Father, in Kabaya Masina, let miracle happen over every request this morning. Let there be a great turnaround over every request this morning. Let there be joy over every request this morning. Let there be manifestation over every request this morning. In the name of Jesus, show up mightily. Hear the voice of your children. Let your life be delivered from that battle, from that struggle. In Jesus' name, we pray. The Bible told us to pray. You know, we accept it. Okay. What happened without adding anything to it? Without adding anything to it, what you have to add to it is just a faith. Faith, you believe what Jesus says, the word of God told us. Without adding anything to it, you believe and you align yourself to it. You believe it, you align yourself to it. You just pray, you pray, and make it happen. You know, that's that evidence of your faith. Without no, no sacrifice, nothing. The Bible told me just to pray, and I pray, I believe God, and I say, I should pray to Him, and you pray to Him, and you see the manifestation. I mean, that God that you cannot see must come to reality. That Jesus you have been told about must come to manifestation in your life. That Jesus must reveal Himself. You are not there, but you believe Him. You believe the story. Some people design, what kind of story? Jesus never exists, is a lie. It's a scam. You know, we say this and that. People say that. People say it. It's a scam. Come on, Jesus Christ. What do you mean by Jesus? Jesus is nobody. Oh, they will demand die. I've seen somebody that says Jesus married. He has a child and he died. <laughs> All kind of stuff people are saying. But now that Jesus that you have been told must prove himself to you. You believe in him. He told Thomas, Thomas saw and said that I will not believe what you are talking about. The story, we saw the man being dead. We buried him. Remember, he was there when Jesus was buried. The disciple was there when Jesus was buried. The man has been buried. I mean, it's over for him. But they told him the man came yesterday because he was not there yesterday. So we saw the Lord yesterday. He said, no, 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 no. Oh, don't tell me. And you, and you, and remember, he has been following him for three years, and he has performed a miracle before Thomas. So you know, but you won't have more. What are you talking about? It's not possible. Among the dead, Jesus, the firstborn. Among, have you ever seen anyone that resurrects? No, he's only the first person I've ever seen that resurrects from dead and dies. No more. That's a different thing, you know. Remember. Resurrect from dead and dies no more. We have seen the scripture that Elijah raised the dead. They threw the, body, the dead of a, a man in the tomb of Elijah. The man raised the dead man, jump up. We have been told, but dies no more. That's the difference. God has used man of God to resurrect things, people, and they're still going to die. Hallelujah. That's why the, the book of Revelation, the Jesus Christ, lived forever. The difference is that, you know, God has resurrected people from death. The testimony of people passed on, the doctors have struck him. You know, you know, I have a story of, of my sister being dead and they put him away. Hallelujah. True story. My own sister was, uh, when she was young, and the, after the doctor check him of this person and the, the true prayer, she rests already. She's still alive today. But she's going to grow to at her old age. And she will, at her old age, she's going to pass on one day. Even though he was rest bring back to life. Was, she was brought back to life. But at one point in time, she will go again. But Jesus is only the first person that, that 
dead and resurrected and is still alive. He lived forever. He's still alive. Not only is he alive in the spirit, he is he is is alive physically. Not only in the spirit, alive because he say, oh, the spirit. It must be a spirit. You know, when they say, you know, I'm not a spirit. I mean, you know, oh, this is a spirit. They, oh, no, he say, no, spirit don't have bone. Spirit cannot eat. So Thomas said, until I touch him, and touch him before I believe what you are talking about. So he touched him. You see, he said, "Blessed are you, touching Thomas, because you see me, you believe. Because you see me touching me, that you see, you saw me that being dead, and also you, now you can again that I'm alive." He said, "Blessed are those that did not like me and you, we did not see him. Hallelujah." We, I have never seen Jesus physically like he's standing in front of me. No. I can see to I've seen him through revelation, but not physically, you know, in front of you like this, like uh hello, hello, sir. That has never happened. Hallelujah. But blessed are you, you believe. So now in reality that your faith must come to manifest. You can't just believe without a backing of faith. You can't just believe without a manifestation of his power. Jesus never said you just believe and believe and believe for believing sake. He wants us to believe and believe and see his power, the manifestation of glory. That confirmation of his resurrection must happen to you, must happen in your own, must happen in your life, must happen in every area. Is that not one? Whatever you ask the Father in my name. The dead are not answer to anything. It's only the living one to show that it's a lie. Every of your requests this morning, every word you trust God this morning, everything that you believe God this morning, Rikatoria Makusa Koriaba, Leprendo Shike Telebon, let it manifest in your life. Oh, what you believe God, oh, what you look unto God, oh, what you trust God, oh, what you put your faith in Him, oh, what you are praying upon, or oh, what you are looking unto God, and we call it out for manifestation, we call it out right now, in the name of Jesus, let that Jesus come so real in your life, let that Jesus come real in your life this morning, come real in your own, come real in your marriage, in every area you are believing God, in every area you take a repasso to your life, that you trust God this morning, receive your miracle. Receive your deliverance. Receive your miracle. Receive your deliverance in the name of Jesus. No more you old captive. No more that will happen again your life. He can arrow sight. Victory is yours. And that victory is permanent. And let the name of Jehovah God be glorified. Thank you, my Father. You will do it this morning. Because your people have put their hope in you. That you are alive. Because your people have put their trust in you. Everyone that has trust you this morning. Father, show up in every area of their life. And let your name in be glorified. Thank you, righteous one. Thank you, faithful king. In Jesus' name, our Lord, we can you. Can I hear that? Hallelujah. I'm just saying to you, shout hallelujah. Shout, is that what you demand from you? Do it. Shout hallelujah wherever you are. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Say praise be his name. Praise be to God. Praise be to Jehovah God. Hallelujah. Praise be to Jehovah God. Praise be to the living one. Praise be to our King. Shout it. Shout it from your heart. Shout it. Shout out praise to him. Menelia Mekodia Shout out praise to the King. Shout out praise to your Savior. In Tayana that is able to do it. Shout out praise to him. Hallelujah. Hallelujah for that healing. Hallelujah for that open door. Hallelujah for that miracle. Hallelujah for that deliverance. Hallelujah for a new thing. Hallelujah for my miracle. Hallelujah.
Hallelujah for my provision. Ika Hallelujah for my protection. Ika Borobo Sada, we thank you. Hallelujah to him. That your people shall praise you and they shall return with the great testimony. By next week, when the door, when the line open to give testimony, your life you will have a testimony. Say that, Amen. A wonderful, a glorious testimony shall happen to you that you will invite the faith of people, that will shake the shake of everyone's life. Oh, Yamakusha Taya, let it happen and let your name, the Lord Jehovah God, be glorified. In Jesus' name, we pray. Amen. 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 Hallelujah. If you believe it, just be expecting it. It is going to happen. Let's hope God by His word that all things are possible for Him and to them also that believes in Him. Hallelujah. Let's put the matter tonight, the uh, night of power, last Friday of the month, like 10. I pray that Lord your God will do great things in our life. Father, I decree, I declare over this water, healing your deliverance over this water, O oh God. Let your people receive their total healing, their total deliverance. Let every, let life be saved. Let life be delivered. And let your name alone be glorified. To everyone trusting God for the fruit of the womb, let your God open their womb, O oh God. Answer them speedily. Let your heart be full of joy. In Jesus' name, our Lord, we pray. Amen. Let's share the grace together. But the grace of the Lord Jesus Christ, the love of God, and the Spirit for the Holy Spirit. Be with us now and forevermore. Amen. Surely, goodness and mercy are followers all the days for life, and we should join us with the Lord forever and ever. Amen. Can somebody shout a big hallelujah? Can somebody shout a big hallelujah? You are blessed and highly favored. God bless you. Thank you for being here. Bye bye.